Okay. Hi, everyone. My name is Ben underscore Burns, and welcome to the two-hour track challenge. <laughs> yeah, right? Because I'm, I'm dumb, and I didn't mention everyone in the, um, in the Discord. So, how's everybody doing today? Uh, we are going to sit down and write a song from scratch in two hours today. I don't have a whole lot of plans, to be honest. Um, to be on, yeah. To be honest, I'm still kind of recovering from uh, from this last weekend. I had a very, very good time up north, away from everything. Um, but I also recorded a ton of videos. Um, and I'll, actually, we got a couple minutes. I can show them to you. Changed legally, yeah. <laughs> um, so I have all of this. All of these are to do now. Um, I have a new audio pack. I'm going to do that I'm working on <laughs> it's wood samples that just make things sound weird um, and then I recorded two pocket operator videos which I really am uh, am no, pleased with I, I got that and then we got like the main shot like that <laughs> nice carbonic <laughs> so um, yeah yeah I got a lot of video to edit <laughs> Apparently the cats are being rowdy out there. <laughs> I also actually I also recorded we get we've got a couple minutes to hang out. So I also recorded a couple time lapses which I'm really which I'm really pleased with. Where are they? Time lapse stuff. Yeah, I got this one. This one was really cool. So I might have a new intro and outro video at some point. I'm not entirely sure. This one was, oh, geez. This one was also a really good one. I like that one a lot. Hey, Madam Barry, how are you? Um, so yeah, I kind of want to try to get some new intro and outro videos at some point and Oh, this was a, this was a GoPro thing. So there's like five thousand image files in here. Um, yeah. So the one thing I was thinking of today, um, Garden Sound posted a video yesterday, and he was talking about some chord progressions, about pivoting on chords. And um, there's this, uh, I think it's C sharp or no D flat major nine thirteen that pivots down to a. Um, B flat major. So I think that you can get, I think there's some cool chord stuff that you can do with these. So I might try to mess with that, um, but oh, sorry, I don't know if I'm going to like lock myself into a, lock myself into anything right away. So yeah, so I might mess with that. Um, I always say I'm going to do a chill jam, but we might do a chill jam today. I don't know. Hey. Uh, sounds like some Marvel movie theme. Yeah, I mean, it's not anything It's not anything fancy. It is, however, um, in the major key. So I don't know if pizza's around, but yeah. Cool. So I started the timer. I should probably do something. Um, so I was thinking about... I guess this would be a lead. Um, I didn't want to do piano, though. I kind of wanted to do something a little bit more electronic. So I'm going to load up contact and see if I can find anything. Okay. Plus some sick break beats, yeah. Um, I mean, I could do, I could do the keys. And I think the keys would probably work pretty well, too. Just like a Where's the notes? 
There's the notes. Um, maybe an organ, but I think an organ feels a little too static. I have vintage organs here. Let's 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 give it a try. Why not? Classic rock, funk and reggae. <laughs> And that might be kind of cool. It's a little... You get some distortion, though. Hmm. I, I don't know if I like the rotary thing, though. It's like all this stuff down here that I never look at. Ooh, maybe unicorda. I, it's like I said no piano, but unicorda might feel like unique enough. I actually really like this. Oh, Toxic, thank you so much for the subscription, man. <laughs> really, really appreciate that. Excuse me. Thank you so much, man. Three months in a row. It means a lot to me. I have to, I'm like I'm like doing three keys at once here. I haven't had a lot of time to practice piano. <laughs> but uh thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um I think I am going to use the una corda though. Um, let's see. But I don't want to do, I don't want to do just like the thing that I always do. It's like, oh, stir drums, brushed drums or whatever you want to call it. And like, let me do something a little bit more upbeat at like 105. Maybe want to do something like five, four time. That might be, that might be enough uh, variation to, uh, Random BPM go, just <laughs> roll a D100 and add 40. Um, With that yeah, that might end up with like a three hundred something BPM. I actually really like how this turned out. Sorry for the tooth whistle, jeez. Now I now I really want to do stirred drums though, because <laughs> this is really good. Oop, that's the wrong note. So it'd be like, I, I I think we can do some really cool like percussive stuff. <laughs> Depends on how uh, how many times you want to do halftime on it. My shoulder still hurts. I'm starting to think I need to see a doctor or a chiropractor or something. Like at one point I was. Uh, 
was I was grabbing something and like I could hear my shoulder pop like it was starting to loosen up whatever tenseness is in there but it's still causing problems I, I'm not I'm not gonna just be like oh well I'm old that's just what happens doctor's office theme for a fake RPG this could totally be that actually that might be kind of cool if you can if you guys can think of a compelling name let's go with that otherwise we'll go with something else These, these kicks are like so resonant. They're like toms. There we go. No, it was like a something else, I think. I'm just kind of grabbing stuff right now. We might. We'll probably change these later. Um, we also need swing on here. Um, where am I looking? I'm looking for 66. Good old. Nah, let's do more than that. I always do 66. Well, that's boring. Is it swung though? Maybe not. These kicks are too uh, too flubby. Let's find a different uh, kit. That's better. Ah. I should close my water bottle before I shake it, though. That was dumb. <laughs> Maybe I do want 33. I just, it's like, I, or 66. I always do 66 for swing. But it works so well. Uh, let's try it without swing. Because there's a couple things I wanted. If we're doing like a doctor scene, we need that. Uh, ch 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 and then really simple hat pattern to kind of keep everything in line.
Okay, now we're getting somewhere. I always try using drum bus and I always regret using it, so I'm just not gonna use it. It needs some reverb, uh, especially this. Okay, next, next step, let's uh, iterate on these drums a little bit. Okay, cool. It's a bit, bit of a chill jam, isn't it? I like where this is going, though. What, uh, anybody have any good uh, song titles yet? I don't, I don't know how to play acoustic guitar. That's like, that's the big problem. It's like, I want to add guitar, but I don't know how to. <laughs> and I don't like how sampled guitar or like a VST guitar sounds. Go for it, man. Here, how about this? Um, desktop if anybody wants to contribute here is a four bar loop of the bass chord progression it is in C sharp major it should be done copying now there you go. Everybody have fun. Any contributions, of course, will always be appreciated. Um, in the meantime, I'm going to see if I can... Uh... Yeah, man. Um, we can just have a, a community to our track challenge today. <laughs> um, but, uh, of course, I'll, I'll keep working on stuff, too. Um I'm wondering if we can go into some of the other stuff over here and this is the the singing stuff. I don't know if the singing stuff's going to work too much, but oops, that's not what I want. I want the instruments, phrases. All right, it's loading. Yeah, it's loading. Oh, it's taking a while to load. Um Let's 
So like if we just like drown this in reverb, that might be kind of cool too. Um, so let's just go like this. <laughs> yeah. I don't know which one I have uh, queued up here. Oh, I have minor. I need major. fit the same style. There's a lot of options, but <laughs> I tried. Let's do something else. That's not going to work here. Yeah, no. Don't save changes. Um I'm just trying random stuff right now. <laughs> That'd be interesting. <laughs> this is all arpeggiated stuff. Oh, Lydian. Oh. Either way. Um, or we can just go something like really simple. Something simple might work too, because the chords and stuff are complex. We shouldn't have to get all wrapped up in, um, you know, making everything complicated. That's so long. This is supposed to be like this. Oh, because I did it for two bars. Nope. I want it faster. That's better. Let's go. Okay. I'm going to turn on another fan because I'm warm. I apologize if there's background noise in the, in the form of fans. Well, that's just the, the price we pay. Um, although this should go into the arpeggios, shouldn't it? So where does this go? I mean, I can I can kind of think of a baseline too. Um, of course, I can go to just my go-to upright, just for bringing something out real quick. But it'd just be like fifths. Maybe. 
I don't know. This is boring. It's boring and dumb. Um, be like do 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 That's that's a pretty good baseline right there. it lower but I think at some point I do want to raise it up so I'm just gonna have that in the pocket and that bass really helps but uh, who was thinking about bass Somebody's thinking about doing bass. And uh, you're more than welcome to still do something. Yeah, there it is. Nell. Sorry, it was like right underneath another message. Um, if you wanted to do bass, like you're more than welcome to. I don't know if this is permanent. I just love the upright bass. Like it works with everything. And it makes me, makes me use it all the time. Um, I mean, I can, I can try to do something different. I'm just going to keep this. I know it's fantastic and I use it all the time and I <laughs> I don't want to. I mean I can just go and like use this, but I feel like okay yeah exactly it's not the same i as much as i would like to use something else it's just like come on ungroup or don't ungroup that's cool I do like the more aggressive snares, but I think that it has to come down to this though.
Okay, so where do we go with this? something random. Oh, it's these things. Nah, no. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Um, oops, I didn't want that one. I wanted these, I think. Could be another song for the melodica. <laughs> now I closed it. I also know what we're missing. We're missing that shaky shaky. I cannot keep time today. Oh my god. No, I did not get the link on the Discord, not yet. a little bit of that. get anything on Discord. Oh, did I put the link on Discord? No, I put it in chat. Sorry, I thought, I thought you asked if I uh, got a link from you. I was like, that was fast, man. Um, here, I'll put it in off topic. Sorry about that. Yeah. 
Jeez, what key am I in? Um, Dark, how you doing, man? Although this might just be in a sharp minor. Um, I'm playing it like it's an A sharp minor anyway, because I'm dumb and I play minor keys all the time. Uh, let's start this with just like as some pads and then um to reinforce those pivot those pivot notes No, there isn't there isn't really a prompt. Uh, just kind of messing around. Ugh, I thought I was an octave higher up. You know, actually, this would probably be better played. Excuse me. I don't know if you're a troll or just an idiot. That's fair. Try not to be either, but you know, I guess that's the lesser of two evils. <laughs> I know the name looks familiar. Yeah, that's what I thought. Got a lot going on right now. Go. 
It's good to see you around. I'm sorry, uh... I don't really remember everybody because I'm dumb. Oh god, this is a 16th note swing. That's why everything sounds like butts. <sighs> ben, what am I gonna do with you? Don't get swing though, because that messes everything up. Oh man, that swing helps so much. Listen to these drums now, man. Yeah. Yeah. Is that what we need to add now? We need to add a yeah? Because I can do that. Yeah. <laughs> Just like the most deadpan. Music. It's so dumb. Gotcha. I actually, my Discord, I use the minimal mode, so I don't see anybody's, like, anybody's icon. Yeah, yeah, I do remember that. It's cool. I appreciate you being here. I'm sorry I don't remember everybody. Uh, bad at uh, everything. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I don't know if I want to keep that one. Yeah. It's like. If we're if we're making like a parody of waiting room music, I think it might actually work pretty well. to get in there and mute it before. <coughs> it's cool, man. We're, we're past it. Don't worry about it. Man, I'm 
I'm sorry. Waiting for bad news. It's too happy for that. Yeah, I turned on uh, low latency for uh, stream delay. So hopefully it's less uh, less crappy than it usually is. Yeah. Sounds about right. Um, waiting for bad news. That's interesting. It's the song title, though. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, I'm sure it'll get done in Mixer at some point, but yeah, I agree. Mixer is definitely way better. in this. I just want the high end. I think we yeah. sufficiently built a pretty solid loop here. Yeah, I used to stream on Mixer. I don't anymore. I, should, I need to remove that. It's just, it's just a pain. That was back when I was multi-streaming to uh, Twitch, YouTube, and Mixer. I'm not doing that anymore. Because it was too much of a pain, and everybody was on Twitch anyway. Yeah. Aside from a select few. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. To be honest, I'd love to stream on Mixer. Let's like try to get an actual intro thing. So we'll have this, but, and this is something that I noticed for other songs where it's just like they start with, yeah. And I don't have anything against Twitch. It's just, uh, it's just, I would rather, um, I like Mixer because of the interactivity and I would love to get more interactive stuff on uh, here, yeah. Uh, because I think interactive stuff is a lot of fun. Where am I going with this? You gotta push all these down.
What, what changed your mind, man? I, I still really like Mixer. No, it doesn't resolve. Yeah, I need to... I just don't like that it stays up there. Slow and buggy. I agree that it is fairly buggy. God, what the hell am I doing here? Just grab these again. It's the same chord. There we go. Well, <laughs> it works most of the time. It, uh, Twitch still has problems, <laughs> but less, less so than they did before. I mean, I can, I can agree to that. Um, but yeah, Twitch is definitely not without fault. Oops, there we go. Yeah, there there have been times where I try to log into like my dashboard or like my admin menu and it's just like blank. It's just like, this page doesn't exist. It's like, okay, I guess I'm not streaming today. So. Okay, so what I wanna do is I wanna have two bars of some kind of like super light intro. And then I really like the idea of having this. to fill in the, oops, fill in the gaps. The other, the other, and this isn't as much of a problem that I had, but the other problem with YouTube streaming is that you, like most of the people who participate in the stream are YouTube commenters, and um, that is often a very toxic community that I don't really want to deal with. I, thankfully, as a creative streamer, that doesn't really affect me as much, but I have joined some other YouTube streams, and it's just like, oh my god, it's, uh, it's pretty brutal. So what I want to do, I think, is I want to create... Hi, Carbonic. Hello again. Hello again, my old friend. Um, <clears throat> maybe try to create... Oops, I wanted to get massive, not contact. Um, try to create a uh, kind of a counter melody that will just kind of appear at the beginning here and then fade out and then in the... In the B section, we can bring it back. Ugh. Yeah, Monster Cat, full of EDM heads. Which, you know, there's nothing wrong with the music, but the, the demographic of the people who usually listen to that music speaks a lot. I guess I'm just speaking my age now. I'm an, I'm an old fart. Cool. I still need a uh, name for this song. I don't know if I like waiting for bad news. Um, it's like, I kind of like it, but I, I, I really also kind of like the, the, the doldrum of it, where it's just like this 
placid kind of just hanging out. Maybe maybe these solos will take it in a completely different direction. You're hoping for a package. Oh. That's what you want to name the song, waiting for a package. <laughs> I I like waiting room, but maybe maybe something other than like Oh man, I do too. I, I, I listen to Monster Cat, I listen to all that other stuff. It's just like the community is not uh it's not not something I like to participate in. This is a little too happy. doing this and, and this is something I'm going to give like five more minutes before um... <laughs> yeah and that makes sense um, I'm going to give this like five more minutes before I axe it but it's just like um... yeah um... Basically, my idea is to create something that doesn't last the whole thing. Why is this here? Have I been editing the wrong damn one? I have. Okay. That's the one I wanted to edit. Um, although I am going to keep these. <clears throat> Um, so it's like, what, what happens? We could, we could get, um, can get a little more abstract with it. So what's usually in a waiting room? There's a, there's a um, coffee table with a bunch of magazines on it. Hey Metro, how you doing? Um, there is a fish tank. Ooh, like call it like the waiting room fish tank or something. <laughs> Or you could go deeper than that, and it's just like the fish tank treasure chest. There's very anxious people here. Oh, I'm sorry. I was gonna load those up. I've I I wanted to like. Oh, in the waiting room. Yeah. Well, it's not frequency shifter. Grain delay is what I'm looking for. Um, Okay, I think I got kind of a, an idea. I uh, I like the idea, <coughs> excuse me, of a fish tank, like the little treasure chest, the chill aquarium. Yeah, like the little ch the the aquarium treasure chest. That's what it is, um, because every fish tank and waiting rooms have those. Um. library with a secret entrance. <laughs> I guess it is. Did you know that that was originally a Justin Timberlake song? Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I've, I've used it. I've used it in a couple other songs, uh, not intentionally. It's not it's not terribly complicated. You're just going up the major scale and then skipping to the fifth. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, it's like if you go C major, it's C. Yeah, C, D, E, A, G. That's not hard. The banger. <laughs> the banger. Okay. I actually kind of like how this sounds. But I'm going to I'm going to work on this for a little bit longer and then basically what I'm doing is I'm uh there isn't. It's um what's happening is I'm using a grain delay which is creating a lot of distortion. So we need a little bit more of an intro for this. Uh, I still might mess with that massive thing a little bit more, but um, let's just go back. <laughs> Oh yeah, we're gonna name this. Let's name this real quick before I forget. So it was the what was it the uh, the, the aquarium treasure chest. That's not how you spell. Oh my god. Why can't I spell? <laughs> I can't spell. Um, I didn't attach a date to it because I'm dumb. Um, the McBurns, yeah. Apparently, I'm not paying attention today. 2018, not 2015. Oh my god, I'm not with it. I'm sorry. How does what happen? Me being a person who can't type? I don't know. I mean, first of all, you have to you have to dissipate all that heat somewhere because to create cold, you have to take heat away from something. So, um, I mean, just like a refrigerator has the um, all those tubes in the back, that's uh, for diffusing heat. Um, so I guess it was just poorly insulated, <coughs> and the wrong stuff caught fire. I'm not a science guy, that's for sure. I just like knowing things. Doesn't necessarily mean I'm right. A lot of the stuff I say, I just talk out of my ass. That sounds more, more accurate. the yeahs make sense anymore.
toxic. You need to spend more time on the, um, the Discord. I don't know if that solo starts at a particular point. I'm just kind of dumping it all in right now. Yeah, what did, I don't know how you recorded these. Is this, oh, it's being warped. I hate that when Ableton does that. guitar that's guitar and then you made a bass track as well this is all cool stuff that can be in the b section yeah <coughs> i think this will this will be cool um so yeah this will all be like the b section stuff and then we'll bring this back over here. Yeah, uh, what whatever works the best for you, I would love to hear it. Take care, man. Thanks for swinging by. Yeah, I like it, though. So I'm gonna I'm just gonna put a guitar rig on this. Something simple. Nope, I wanted something cleaner than that. Guitar, cool. around here oh, loops to here so we can do the same chord progression I guess
fast. I really want to get that major in there, but maybe we, you can like save that for like the eighth bar or something. Helps if you push the right notes. a start so everything's off because i can't count um well that's okay it also would have helped if i had like some basic drums playing or something but you know why plan ahead when you could just fix all your mistakes <laughs> like obviously some work left to do but but <clears throat> but buts um choose the fruit Yeah, and deleting mistakes is another way of going about it, but I don't like deleting mistakes. I think that mistakes still have merit in a lot of cases. Um, not always, but it's uh, sometimes good to see if you can salvage something. actually starting to feel like I need different drums for this. <clears throat> Time do I got? 50 minutes left. I mean, we're, we're pretty much, excuse me, we're still on track for, uh, we're still on track, which is good. Um, If we really wanted to make this a jam session, we can go like this, but most likely we'll just do two loops. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I totally missed that link. I got, I got wrapped up. I got it. It's all good. Let's uh let's just make another lead thing up here. This is actually perfect for the intro. Okay, 
Um, so there's a couple of things we can do here. Uh, we can extend out the intro a little bit um, because I really like that. And in doing so, yeah, let's cut things right here. And then we can have like a B section kind of thing start here. So we're gonna have <clears throat> a little bit of a jam session or something. Right, this actually needs to go out to here. Oops, I nipped off the end of that, didn't I? Shoop, oh, there's a lot of it. Nipped off a lot of it. There we go. Um, <clears throat> so I'm thinking what we can do is we can like kind of turn this into a, a automated wash of sound and then like it kind of sharpens up near the middle here and then kind of fades away again my thought so we can go like this to this to this to this and then we'll have a reverb at the end here and it kind of does the opposite where it's like like that And then this can actually get moved way over here. And then we can join these. And make it a little bit more different here for uh, you've been doing well too been uh been busy but that's that's nothing new <laughs> yeah i'd like to i'd like to do more of this stuff in the future i mean i i like how this is turning out it's still a bit of a still a bit of a mess but it's it's getting there Yeah, a little bit. All right, all right. Yeah, I'd love some I'd love some actual guitar skills. Let's let's look at this uh I don't think it's that far off. feel it's that much of a clash. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, I like it too. It's nice and simple. I mean, all this is is it's um, a low pass or a high pass. No, it is a low pass. I always get those backwards. Um, with a basic, I call it a flare. <coughs> Excuse me. Basically, instead of having a, a, a straight attack like this would be, um, you you flare out the attack, so the attack takes like uh, 150 milliseconds. Or maybe it was longer than that. No, 109. So when you play chords, yeah, it's kind of just like a cheap FM trumpet, yeah. Maybe. I don't know, I have my own words. <laughs> So we need some kind of a, um, just kind of a lead in uh, for this. And I think that just a simple uplifter will do just fine. Let's see if there's, this is like gonna be like, yeah, these are for fucking the wrong style of music. Mouth noises, yeah, I was kind of thinking that. Um, I just know I do that a lot. I just uh, wanted to see if I could find something. Yeah, cool. Prada snares. That's exactly what I'm looking for. Um, <clears throat> a super basic siren thingy. Yeah, I don't want it to be like an EDM riser, though. I mean, I could just take a reversed snare or not a reverse snare reverse symbol i guess that's probably the best way to go about it uh drum kits i mean even something like that might work maybe yeah actually that works really well You just gotta add some more, some a little more effects in it to make it uh, make it fit within the song. Okay, as as far as the tom patterns are concerned, yeah, I can totally see um, adding some of those. I just need to find the right. Acoustic close. Do I have Tom Tomcats? Do I have Tom in here? I do not. That's snares. God, there's so many samples in this pack. How do I hold all these answers? These don't have toms. I thought they did. Ride rack tom. It's just one of them, though. I thought there was. Yeah, it's pitch shifted, I guess. Yeah, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, not because it's, I don't want to, but I'm trying to like not do drum machines for like one song in my life. Yeah. 
because I tend to do drum machines a lot and I'd like to I'd like to make sure that I'm not just doing drum machines in every song. I say that while I use the uh, upright bass in basically every song, so what do I know? Um, So good. All right. I don't think I can keep the vo voice thing in there as much as I want to. this start on the one carbonic or is this like something that comes in later because it feels off and I know I know there's a little gap here I didn't know if that was intentional or not okay That does sound a little better. Okay. solo man <laughs> excuse me which is fine man 30 minutes left this time is flying by yeah yeah I might I might uh, I might uh, slice it up a little bit but I like it overall <laughs> that's the spirit I guess this just really okay what i should do is i should finish the arrangement and then i should go back and like make things fancy <clears throat> yeah we're still here man don't have to feel sad
okay, so instead of the yeahs and the whatevers, maybe we should do like bubble sounds, like waves. I think that might work. That's something I did in a, in a two-hour track challenge a long time ago. Like all of my risers and all of my um, and all of my uh, like interstitial noises were all like wave and bubble related. Reverby bellish stuff. That's a good idea too. Um, there's a, there's a recording of waves that I have that's like really close to the water. Okay. Okay. I think it's this one. Okay, this cannot have any of these effects. Well, maybe the... This is it. That's the whole Shut up, Ben. Get two different. Shut up, Ben. And then. Shut up, Ben. Yeah, that kind of splashy sound is what I'm looking for. So if I can take this and like raise it. I know what I want, I just don't know if I can do it. Give me one second, I'll be right back. That should work. I think. It's still going, but whatever. <laughs> Sounds like an aquarium, kinda. Hey, look, my printer's out of ink. I don't care. Okay, so we can take this. This is kind of a weird aside, but 
If we can make it work, it'll be really cool. I think my wife just printed something. And since the, the computer is connected, or the printer is connected to the network. I think that kind of works. Just go like that for now. Um, or grab a different sample and just like take this and then go like this. Why did that go over? There. There. And it goes like this, like this. There we go. We did it. I still kind of want ocean waves in the background. Maybe, maybe the, um, maybe the middle bit here will be, um, <coughs> excuse me, more wave based. You just take this and go like this and be like, yeah, there we go, waves. A little loud, but you know. I'll definitely I'll be chopping. <laughs> I'll be chopping that down a little bit. That's okay. So, uh, 25 minutes left. Poison my water now. I don't think that straw's been used in like five years. when that everything comes back. Um. <clears throat> I'm gonna change this around a little bit too. that.
just meanders a little bit. I, I really love the solo, but I don't know if it feels like it fits. gonna focus on this for a minute. I, I think I'm trying to do too many things at the same time. That's because of the swing. I don't think that's because of you. pattern i like what you did but like the swing really messed everything up <laughs> it's cool we can fix it Ugh. one thing at a time let's go like this this to save time. Cool. I might, I might use that too. like <clears throat> we'll have uh 16 bars or eight bars of uh of a solo and then we can we can put the piano and stuff in the background um because we can't have both going on at the same time Honestly, don't think I'll have space for this. Uh, both time, mostly time. <laughs> it's cool though. It's still there. I didn't delete it forever. It's just not, not on the timeline right now. Oop. Okay.
Shadow? How have you been, by the way? I think what this needs is a little bit more air to it. Um, Nice. Lots of cool magic tracks, m magic music tracks done. Uh, collabs with singers. Uh, not many collaborations with singers. Maybe someday. Um, I have I have ideas. I have lots of ideas. Um, it's just getting those ideas out there. Oh, these are here. That's not the problem. Okay, it's this that's the problem. Yep, collabs are weird. Pretty much just a fade out kind of song right here, I think. Because the whole point is you're in a waiting room. So that kind of makes sense. It's super chill, and I'm okay with that today. Um, I like I either wanted to do a really chill song like this, or I wanted to do a really aggressive song, and I guess this one kind of won out because uh, this one's a lot. I don't want to say easier because it's not easier to make. There's a lot of complex things going on. But. Ugh. I did that once. It's called Into the Machine. I did not like it. Ugh, jeez.
cannot play anymore. First of all, the pedal was stuck on for I don't know how long. Trying to make it too complex. Yeah, it should be on YouTube. I, uh, I've been, I need to go through all my YouTube stuff. I know it links to the wrong place now. get it. Yep. I don't know. I'm just doing little riffs here because I gotta, gotta make it interesting. I know we only have like five minutes left. Yeah. It's all good. If we go a little bit over, that's not the end of the world. This is actually a pretty cool song to work on. Yeah, that's uh That sounds like crap. What was I trying to do? It's like I'm just trying to add just a little bit of a break to I think that's what I wanted.
Ecco. Got to resolve that chord too. Yep, that's kind of that's kind of what we ended up with. Uh, it was aquarium treasure chest. So. kind of like you go to an aquarium or you go to a waiting room there's always like a an aquarium and those aquariums always have treasure chests in them take care man thanks for swinging by and hanging out Five minutes. Okay. Um, I wanted to make sure this transition is good, which it should be. Oh, hi, pizza. some changes there okay um so it kind of works to building up again monophonic so I don't think so is not getting released on these and it's like screwing everything up. Oh, yeah, that would do it. <laughs> I should have like one of those in there.
Take care, Carbonic. Well, we got 40 seconds left, so there's not much, uh, not much left to do anyway. I don't want to end on a discordant. Oops, yeah, there we go. Okay, let's listen to the song as a whole, but I think we're pretty much done. Aquarium treasure chest. on this note for way 
too long. And it pisses me off. I know, we're over time. Of course the hold pedals fucked up again. It's one thing I wish Ableton was better at. Um, if that if like the up or the off doesn't get resolved, it just stays on forever. And it just drives me nuts. Okay, this song is done. Um, let's listen to it and then we'll be done and good. And yeah. Let's find somebody to raid too. Because I need to do that more. See if anybody's even online. Eh, a couple people.
sick of hearing that note. So, this has been the two-hour track challenge. We went a little over, but not by a whole lot. And the song turned out pretty dang neat, if I don't say so myself. Um, if you are interested in talking with me further, you can find me on Twitter at Ben underscore Burns. That's B-U-R-N-E-S. If you wanted to support this channel and download this song for your own personal listening pleasure, uh, you can support me on Patreon at patreon.com slash Ben underscore Burns. Um, One dollar a month will get you all of the two-hour track challenges that I've done so far, which is almost 150, including a secret album that only patrons have access to. Um, and a couple other things, too. Uh, aside from that, I think we are good to go. I am going to um, host Rin the Yordle. Um, she is a super cool streamer. I don't have uh, audio on right now, but she does a lot of art stuff. Um, she's actually like um, part of like Photoshop. I think she's like partnered with Photoshop and Twitch and a bunch of other stuff. She's super, super cool. So I am going to um, send everybody over to her. Be sure to say hello. And um, I think I'm going to end the stream. Guys, thank you so much for hanging out. It's been a lot of fun. Um, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye.